In this episode, we will verify the password and email inputs. If the inputs are correct, the project must determine the type of login. Whether it is using an email or using the ID number for the account. Then the project must determine the inputs allowed for writing and distinguish the inputs if they are numbers or letters or symbols, and the type of allowed input must be distinguished. As well as the length of the allowed input, the shortest allowed input, the strength of the password, and the length of the password strength. Here I will add a check to check if the input contains prohibited symbols. If the entries are valid, you must check the entries if they contain an email indication.